Hey guys, FIFA Vic here with FIFA 13 pack opening for you guys. Bundesliga, Tots is out. And there's some amazing players. There's Rice, there is Ribery, there is Lewandowski, there is loads of amazing Bundesliga players. And uh, so I've got um, about 15, 1600 FIFA points. And so I'm going to smash open some packs for you guys. Um, nothing too amazing in this first pack. I'll just be sending everything to the club. Nastasic obviously did have a tots, but uh, yeah, nothing too amazing. A nice uh, formation card there, but uh, yeah, so I'll do some talking, some nonsense, and uh, you can watch the packs uh, be opened. I will speed up after this pack. I'm quite slick at doing the pack openings after a bit. Um, so all that goes away and we'll crack another one open. I'll keep opening the premium packs up. Unfortunately, there aren't any bigger packs or I could save us all some time, but there is not. Um, Bundesliga, what a, what a year Bundesliga has had. Very, very deserving in a very, very strong team of the season uh, squad. Um, absolutely beast league to be in. Um, the top, you know, the top 50 players in Bundesliga are just the top 50 players in the world, straight up. Um, and so, yeah, so there's going to be some amazing players. Um, guys, Xbox One reveal yesterday. Um, obviously, a lot of FIFA hype around the Xbox One reveal, um, simply because they did mention FIFA in their reveal with some of the information, and I saw a lot of nonsense on Twitter. Um, a lot of people getting a bit confused about what they were actually announcing. Now, um, what they actually announced for the Xbox One, just to clear it up if anyone's still confused or there's still rumours going round, um, FIFA Ultimate Team will be on the PS4 and it will be on the Xbox One. However, um, the X Xbox Microsoft guys have managed to get some exclusive functionality on next year's FIFA Ultimate Team uh, that, that won't be available on the PlayStation. Now, this might turn out to be um, legendary cards, or um, certain stadiums, or certain players' faces, or something like that. Um, a, a weekly challenge of some sort, um, special tournaments for special prizes. Um, it could be something like that. Um, but uh, it, won't, it won't be anything mind-blowing. It, it won't be anything ridiculously game-changing. It will just be a nice little perk for Xbox users, but uh, don't panic. It's not the death of PlayStation. Um, it doesn't mean that every FIFA YouTuber is going to be on a Microsoft machine. There's still going to be loads of PlayStation FIFA players in the world. Um, so don't worry about all that too much. That's how I understand it. That's how it's been explained to me. And um, yeah, so don't worry too much about all that. Um, the best thing to look at, if you're if you're, st if you're still a bit confused, if you look at um, Call of Duty over the last 12 months, how that has behaved on the two consoles, it might be very similar to that. Now, um, what that what that happens on Call of Duty is that map new map packs get released a couple of weeks earlier on Xbox than they do on PlayStation, and it could well be something like that. So um, yeah. So that's, all in all, it was an interesting um, broadcast, an interesting release. Um, it was loads of media focus, loads of multimedia focus on the new Xbox. It's going to be like the um, such an amazing multimedia system. Everyone's going to want one in their living room because it's got like such instant access to Skype, Netflix, integration to all the social stuff. Um, you, and all that sort of stuff. It's going to be like a beast TV and it's going to have Blu-ray. So they've really focused on the entertainment side of it. Um, and uh, it looked to have very good gaming specs if you compared it to a gaming PC as well. So it's going to be very powerful and they're going to be able to make some amazing games as well. But uh, I'm sure they will be able to make the same amount of amazing games for PlayStation. Interesting that they are focusing on unique content and... Um, uh, content that is designated only Microsoft. It might lead to some games only coming out for Microsoft in the future, but Sony will respond and there'll be some Sony only games in the future. It might go back to the old days where you had Nintendo, Mario, Sega, Sonic. You know, it could go back to those days. But very interesting indeed, oh. 
Um, we're cracking these packs open. Um, the best player we've probably got so far is like Wagner Love or someone like that. Um, amazing how many players that are no longer that like last week's team of the weeks. It's amazing how many of last week's team of the weeks you get this week. Last week's team of the seasons you get this week. I think we've got a statue in one of these packs or something. Um, it's just crazy. Um, no pack look at all, guys. Uh, let me know, guys, in the comments. At this stage, obviously, you don't. This isn't you pre-ordering the console. But in the comments, just say, um, are you going to buy a PS? As it stands right now, with the information you've got right now, are you getting a PS4? Or are you getting an Xbox One? Let me know, guys. If you're still watching at this point, good on you. Um, and uh, because as a reward for listening to me for this long, um, I am going to tell you about tomorrow's TV program. We are going to be seeing a new series from me. Well, it's not like a series. It's going to be like a weekly video thing. Um, a new series called Black and Blue, uh, where I review one informed player and one team of the season player. But I'm going to review them in a what I feel is quite a unique format. Um, and we're going to be doing all sorts of things with that. So look forward to Black and Blue. Um, if you are new to my channel, please hit subscribe. Um, always like all my videos and all that stuff. No, seriously, uh, do check out some of my older videos. You might get a better idea of what I do. I'm only doing the pack openings because it's a uh, team of the season time, so it's quite interesting to see what's going on. I'm usually doing RTGs and squad builders. Another shout out to Zebak HD, who I have set up a rivalry um, series potentially with. We've got, we've just had a match. Um, against each other. He had a German FIFA Ultimate Team. I had an English FIFA Ultimate Team. Uh, we played a match and the video is up on his channel. Go and support that. Go check it out. If it gets enough interest, we're going to turn it into like a rivalry series potentially. Um, so uh, I'll put the information in the description. So go and have a look at that, please. Um, in the packs, uh, this is the last pack. We get Dembushi. I think it's the last pack. We get Dembushi. Uh, the Newcastle French right back. Um, we get two position cards and we get a thousand coins as well, which isn't the worst thing in the world ever. Thank you for watching this long. Uh, let me know your thoughts on Xbox. I've been Fifi